to a typical vagabond. Join me in my adventure to find a home. All right, welcome back, Via Gabons. Glad that you're here. Uh, taking you around some of the places that you can find here to get food. Uh, some people were kind of wondering about different supermarkets, uh, things like that. I've been getting questions. Um, just kind of, uh, how do I go about getting uh, food around here besides going to a restaurant? Because I can get kind of expensive over a period of time. Uh, anyway, I figured that I would take you around to some of the uh, different places that you can go. I showed a couple of the uh, supermercados, the uh, Pingo Dos, and uh, Continent. Um, there's also a Lidl, Aldi. There's also other continents through that are even bigger than, than this one. So if you need to different types of stuff. You can find anything that you want uh, at these other locations. But uh, yeah, let me go ahead and take you on to some, some maybe the other places that you might not notice as much on uh, these side streets down in uh, the Baeja. So you can go to some of these uh, little mercados. All right, so I showed you some of the different uh, mercados uh, in the alleyways that you can get food in the uh, Baja. You can get different types of fruits, you can get bread, uh, and you have to kind of go to each different place to get uh, what, what they make. Uh, you, you can even go to one of the roasted chicken places. They spatchcock a chicken and end up uh, uh, roasting it and those are some of the best chickens that I've ever had uh, but yeah it's absolutely fantastic being able to go out and just walk the streets and get the food that you need each day every day you get like fresh food and uh, yeah it's absolutely wonderful but I'll show you some uh, some of the other things that you can find there's also some smaller um, smaller uh, supermercados supermarkets so they're kind of a little bit a little bit uh smaller so it's kind of kind of nice to uh pop into one of those if it's just nearby and and bring bring some stuff home too all right so i'm gonna go ahead and leave here from the uh park verde which is down uh down here it is a uh, beautiful park that's along the river uh, and it's absolutely gorgeous. We have some of the leaves falling down, uh, so it's starting to become a nice fall day. Things are starting to cool down a little bit uh, um, during the day and at night, so it's not uh, nearly as hot. But yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and continue walking a little bit. All right, I am here at the Municipal uh, Mercado. Uh, this is another place that you can get fresh fruits, vegetables. Um, it's like all the fruits that you'd want. You want apples, you want oranges. They got the stuff here. Uh, they got plums, they got bananas, nuts, uh, you know, cashews, um, all kinds of uh, different uh, fresh items. So you can uh, get, uh, um, yeah, as I was saying, all the fresh fruits that you'd want. You have uh, you know, cabbage, onions, uh, garlic, uh, bell peppers. Um, yeah, all all the all those type of uh, vegetables too that you'd want. Um, bell peppers, red peppers, green peppers, orange, yellow, all those good things for you that are 
that are healthy. Uh, so, and you know, if you're a meat eater, they you can get sausage, fresh sausage that's been made. There is chicken, pork, um, beef, chicken. Uh, I'm not sure if I said chicken, but chicken, chicken, chicken. They like chicken here. Um, and uh, they also have fresh seafood. So like everything uh, inside has uh, is on ice with the, the seafood. So it's kind of nice. Uh, but before I take you inside, uh, hit the like button if you haven't already. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed yet. And uh, hit the uh, bell to be notified. And uh, until then, at the y'all.